My name is Rob Brinner. Uh, I think you know that. I think you know that my father was born here on Alyutskaya Street. That his uh, father, Boris Brinner, was... My grandfather, Boris Brinner, was the Minister of Industry of the Far East Russian Republic during its short existence. And in fact, my father was born in Vladivostok, but he was not born in Russia or in the Soviet Union. He was born in the Far East Russian Republic. He was born in 1920. Uh, I first came here exactly 10 years ago. I received an invitation from now my Russian brother, uh, Sasha Deluda, who was created, helping to create the first film festival. And so I was sitting on a hill, my hilltop in the country, in New York. I don't live in cities. And uh, uh, I got this email that says, he sent me an email that inviting me to the film festival to present the first Yule Brinner Award in the city where he was born. And the email ended with the words, uh, your name Rok in Russian means destiny, and it's your destiny to come to Vladivostok. And here it is 10 years later, and I've been here 15 times, uh, taking the very long trip to get here. Uh, and there's no question, I love this city more than any other city. As I said, I don't like cities, but I deeply love Vladivostok, and it has become very much my second home. I grew up mostly in New York City, but then my father was doing the play called The King and I, which he later made the film of and won his Oscar for that film. That's why the statue is not of Yule in Velikelopnaya Senyorka, but rather from The King and I. And uh, he played that role on stage for a total of 14 years of his life. Four years uh, in the 1950s, and then the last 10 years of his life, doing eight performances a week. So that, the statue had to be of the King and I. Uh, I grew up touring with the King and I, with the play. We toured America. We lived on a train. We had our own train. Uh, and so I got to see America, and then when I was about 10 years old, we moved to Switzerland, which is where my great-grandfather was from. My ambition growing up was to, um, to be a Renaissance man. I wanted to see the world from as many different perspectives as I could. And so over the course of my life, I starred in a one-man show on Broadway that I wrote. I uh, was a computer programmer for Bank of America. I was a pilot with my own twin engine airplane. I was a very cool guy at that point. Uh, I, was, I was road manager for Bob Dylan and the band. I was bodyguard to Muhammad Ali during his championship years. Yes, it's true. When the greatest fighter in all human history needed someone to protect him, I was the guy. Uh, I also helped create a little hamburger business in London called the Hard Rock Cafe and started the first sushi bar in Malibu, California, called Something's Fishy Here. Um, and uh, I have, I did a, ma a bachelor's and master's degree in philosophy at Trinity College Dublin, and then later did my doctorate in American history at Columbia University. I have been a professor of history for the last decade. I was also a professor of political science. Uh, I was a street clown. I was a hippie. 